Kevin. Lovely to meet you. Hello, Anita. Welcome to Victoria Square. I'm very excited to see what you have to offer. Well, let me today. tell you about the uh, development. Yeah, let's have a look. Oh, so this is it here. Wow, where do we start? Because there's just so much happening. It's absolutely beautiful. Yeah, so this is Victoria Square. It's in the heart of the Joseph Road Precinct here in Footscray. Okay, it's actually beautifully designed. Um, who, who's done this? Yeah, the architect for this project uh, and the second stage is Fender Catsalidis Architecture. Okay. They've been uh, working in Melbourne and have created some of the most notable buildings in Melbourne. Yeah, there's a little bit of a flow I'm seeing with all of this. Is that, is that yes, true? Yes, so they've taken their architectural cues from the bend, so the Maribyrnong River, oh, which okay. passes 100 metres from the site here. Yeah, and that's reflected right. in the architecture, the features of the sweeping facade lines. Yeah. Uh, it's also, they've taken a lot of design cues from the old wharfing and, and port of Footscray that used to occur, so that's re reflected in all of the sort of aged timbers in mm. the facade. What is this running track that's going all the way around? Well, we've been really fortunate. <laughs> we've taken that as an opportunity to create Australia's first 400 metre Olympic size running track. Okay. So if you're the type of resident that likes to get up and have a morning run and want to do that in the safety of your own community, you can you get can. up and, and pound. Well now you feel guilty if you're not going to use it. So everyone that actually lives here has got no excuse to be fit. Exactly. <laughs> okay, that's brilliant. What are some of the other um, amazing features that are a little bit unique to this building? So the other main attractor for this building is this giant sky garden. Okay. covers the entire podium. Mm. So for those that just want some sanctuary or want to get up on a Saturday morning and sip their coffee in the sun and sit out lovely in these beautiful gardens that are created here, which often has been you know, a criticism of apartment style living, exactly. not in an outdoor space. So we've really yeah. catered for, for everybody in this development. There's yeah. a home cinema that can be booked. There's a beautiful private dining room where you can have your birthday parties. There's a, a billiards room. So yeah, it really is, there's something for everybody here. And um, another thing which I like the idea of is the indoor swimming pool, it's heated. It is, yes. Which it's isn't always the case with apartment living. 25 metre lap pool. Okay. Next door to the um, president's gym. Fantastic. Well, Kevin, I love the outside of the apartments. Can't wait to have a look inside. Can we go have a look? Let me take you through. Perfect. So Kevin, we're in beautiful Footscray here. Tell us a little bit about this area. Footscray is definitely a suburb on the, on the rise. Uh, historically, it may have been seen the poor cousin of some of the uh, inner north and inner east suburbs, mm -hmm. but that transformation is, is well underway and has been for the last five years. Footscray's always had that great location. Mm -hmm. From where we are here, it's only three train stops to the CBD, mm -hmm. 15 minutes on the bike paths, which pass right by the door here. Yeah. So there's a lot of great things going on with 100 metres from the Maribyrnong River as well. So for those people who like their riverfront activity and lifestyle. Yeah, that get little up. bit of nature. Yeah, so there's a lot on offer here. What I like about what you've done with Victoria Square is that you haven't just built these apartment homes. You've also built all the restaurants and all the recreational activities as well. So you've built a community. Absolutely. So eventually there'll be a thousand dwellings here. Mm -hmm. um, so you make, need to make sure that you actually provide more than just somewhere for them to live. Mm -hmm. So we'll have the creation of what's called the Ward Street Extension, yeah. which is going to be a full food retail strip. Fantastic. Available not only to residents of uh, Vic Square, but also everyone in the Joseph Road precinct and broader Footscray. And we started construction late last year. Okay. So we, we are aiming for completion late next year and our first occupants will be starting to move in. That's fantastic. It's really fast. Yeah, it's very fast. So Kevin, I'd love to see the inside of one of these apartments. Can we go have a look? Yeah, let me show you for a walk through. Perfect. So come on in, Anita. Wow, Kevin, I love it. I love kitchens because I love cooking. Yeah, they so are the, the heart of every home. And we've really strived to make these kitchens feel like a really high quality home kitchen. And I can definitely see that in the appliances here. So what type of appliances and decor is all of this? So yeah, we've got uh, Bosch appliances throughout. Mm -hmm. We've got lovely engineered stone bench tops, mm -hmm. great overhead cupboards, lots of storage, integrated. Lots of space. Oh, in it's a hidden fridge. <laughs> integrated refrigeration. And do you know what I love, which I've just noticed, is this. Soft clothes. <laughs> no bang. <laughs> so what I'm getting at, just by looking at the kitchen here, is the story that was displayed in the outside architecture, it's flowing inside absolutely, yeah. and so it's that, telling a story. Absolutely, it's all linked mm -hmm. uh, and trying to get back to the materiality and colour palettes and choice that's been inspired by the local existing architecture. 
Now this island table, I understand it doesn't matter whether you buy a one, two or three bedroom, this is included in every That's single apartment. That's absolutely right, yeah, every, every apartment from the, the one bed is all the way up. So you've got the space. That's fantastic. Mm. So Kevin, I'm loving the kitchen area. What's next? Let me take you through to the bathroom. Fantastic. Automatically when I walked in here, what jumped out was this openness and this brightness, which normally um, to an apartment living to me is usually quite um, small and dark. And this is just the complete opposite. This is fantastic. Yeah, you're right. The, the challenge of apartments is actually making the bathrooms feel as large as possible. And I think our interior designers have done a fantastic job of it. They have, just with the colour schemes as well, just all linking together, just to open it up a little bit. Can you also get the dark colour scheme in here as well? You can, yes. So the material choices here are reflective of the kitchen joinery to bring the whole entire apartment mm -hmm. design together. I'm loving the shower because it's so big. Uh, much more generous than you might find in other apartments. Absolutely. I guess yes. we've also, also featured lots of uh, storage in these bathrooms, which is something that's um, rare to find. Oh yes, and that goes all the way down as well. It does, yes. Okay, all storage. And I love in the basin as well, the sharp edges and then mixing in with the curves as well. It's amazing because the story just keeps flowing from the outside architecture into the interiors just perfectly. That's right. And let's demonstrate. This is a custom design hand basin. Yep. No, it's beautiful. And the wood as well. So linking in to those, that nature, that natural living and... Yeah, drawing on external inspiration. Perfect. No, I'm loving it. It's just ticking all the boxes. So now let's um, talk about price here. What are the one bedroom starting at? Two bedroom and three bedrooms. Yeah, so they're very affordable for apartments this close to the city. Mm -hmm. One bedroom apartments starting at three ninety nine. Fantastic. Two bedroom apartments starting at five seventy. Okay, and then up to three bedroom as well? Yes, there are some three bedrooms and they range in price. But definitely very affordable. We've had a lot of fun. They're beautiful apartments. Thank you so much for showing Thank me Thank you, Anita. It's been a pleasure. <laughs>